This is Ken Hans, the best storyteller in Texas. Thanks for listening. We hope you enjoyed today's segment. I wanted to mention something today. Uh, one of my friends and listeners, uh, J. Michael Lewis, uh, who uh, is a Texas Tech guy, chairman of the board, did an excellent job as a uh, board member at Texas Tech and chairman of the board. He uh, corrected me. on. Uh, he was listening to one of my podcasts, and I said that the Rock Inn Cafe in Seymour was located, and Seymour's located between Dallas and Lubbock. And he wrote me and said, uh, no, it's located between Olney and Benjamin. And, you know, he narrowed it down a little closer. And he, the reason he did that, he grew up in Olney. And uh, he didn't want Olney to be cheated out of being close uh, to, uh, uh, to Seymour, the Rock Inn Cafe. That's, I, I've always used Rock Inn as uh, an example. In one of my classes, I talked to him about body language. If you go in the Rock Inn Cafe and you go sit down on a stool up by the bar and you say coffee, what do they do? Well, they will bring you some coffee. And then later they give you a ticket. You say, well, I didn't offer to buy coffee. Well, you, you know, they assume that because of your actions. But if you'd gone in and you had a question mark on your face and your voice, instead of saying coffee, you said, uh, coffee? You know, uh, is, would they, yes, we have coffee. And so body language is, is very, very important. Uh, I had a, we were negotiating for a loan one time, and one of the guys involved in it was cleaning his nails with a switchblade. You know, I don't know what he's trying to prove, but it didn't prove much to me. Uh, but I guess he was trying to be tough or something. I, I, you know, I have no idea. But pe- people have a tendency to, to, have certain things that will mislead you when you're doing negotiation. And uh, I'm always aware of that. Uh, stay focused on what you, what do you want out of this deal? What do you want today? When I meet with people, what is the purpose of this meeting? And what do I want to come out? You know vaguely what the purpose is going in, maybe to buy a property or whatever. You've got to focus on how do I buy this property as, as quickly as possible. But to J. Michael Lewis, uh, we will correct it, and the record will show that the Rock Inn in Seymour, Texas, on California Street, is between Olney, the home of J. Michael Lewis, and Benjamin. Where Benjamin, don't speed through Benjamin. Uh, they're waiting on you. Uh, they, they are, uh, you know, it's slow day in Benjamin. It's going to be a fast day to the J.P.'s office to pay for that ticket.